a beautiful day to go antique shopping. Because that's what all young, hot, single LA girls do on Saturday night. Yes, that's me, and you already know I'm 29 going on 99. I have a flea market schedule. That's what my life is now. <laughs> I love old lady decor, and ever since I bought my dream house last year, y'all know I've been dedicating my time to make it a true grandma fantasy. So from books to curtains to flowers to everything in between, the Sky Castle presents Decorating My House Like a Little Old Lady. <laughs> Hi guys, it's Amber. Welcome back to the Sky Castle. It has been a minute since I did a home, you know, some kind of like home video. So that's what we're doing today. Dun -da -da. This is literally the ultimate most grandma of grandma activities is coming to a flea market at 7 a.m. on a Sunday. Like they have these beautiful grandma pillows and little grandma frames. Oh! I love flea markets. They are literally my favorite place to shop. And this one is so fun. Like look how cute everything is. Oh! They just have the most unique things. Like look at this little silver trays. Oh, this is actually really beautiful. I love stuff like this. Strange trinkets. Oh, look at all the beautiful glassware. Oh my gosh, gorgeous. These are so cute, oh my god. Oh wow, these are hand painted. Beautiful little trinket boxes. Oh. Like I said, I am 900 years old. I just love this. Like look, they even sell literal grandma quilts. Adorable. I am obsessed with flea markets. I literally frequent them all. I have a flea market schedule. That's what my life is now. <laughs> I wouldn't change it. I love being old. Look at all the books. Oh my goodness, I love books. Emerson's essays, this is so cool. These are gorgeous. Look at this, this is like real 24 karat gold gilt. Oh. What could I do with this? I literally don't even have a table, but maybe I should have a nice gilt china set. My priorities make no sense, but they're always fabulous. Oh, look how beautiful. Little old lady hats, hello. Oh wow, this matches my outfit. <laughs> this is pretty. This is kind of cool. This is for a fireplace. I don't know, that could be kind of fun. Wait, no, is it this? Yeah. All right, next stop, we're going to the antique annex in Pasadena. <laughs> I am 95. Oh yeah, the Pasadena Antique Center. <laughs> I am way too excited about this. Like how stinking cool is this place? Look, it's just like another giant treasure hunt land. You guys are always asking where I get all this weird stuff for my house. It's places like this. You would never see this literally anywhere. Every turn a surprise. Wow. So many cute little things. This is beautiful. What's the funniest thing you've ever seen in an antique store? I'll start. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. Stuff from the past is just so cool. Actually, that mirror is really cool. <laughs> the last thing I need is more mirrors, but still. Cute little vanity. Hmm. Oh my god, I love this frame. <laughs> Look at this. How cool. Oh, beautiful. Ooh, look at all the art. Wow. So beautiful. These are beautiful frames. It would be weird to hang that man in my house, but ignore him. Could be gorgeous. So exciting! The chaos of being me, I swear. You guys know I love this store. Talk about an old lady store. This is just full of old lady things. I'm obsessed with it. It's like a little grandma's closet. <laughs> okay, let's see what to get today, shall we? Look at all the tiny little goodies. Beautiful. One of these days, I gotta get my own little cabinet full of treasures because I just love them. A very little tiny chair. Oh! I usually do size checks for big things, but look at this. This is so little. Go upstairs real quick. Oh, like, isn't this so fun? Look at this place! 
It's literally old lady heaven. Literally goals? I need this. If it wasn't $14,000, maybe I'd get it. <laughs> they also have a bunch of beautiful old books. Hmm, which ones should we get today? I always feel like I have to whisper in here, even though I'm literally the only person in here. <laughs> <sighs> I come here like every week, I'm not even kidding, once a week at least, and spend like two hours in here. <laughs> Something about it's relaxing. It's actually, even this is cool. <laughs> Ooh, like I love empty perfume bottles. This is pretty. Y'all already know I literally collect perfumes, but I don't really love the way most perfumes smell. So an empty bottle is great for me. <laughs> Nothing I do makes any sense. It's just all for the vibes. This is beautiful too. Hmm. I know guys, I just stopped for ice cream on the way home and literally the cashier said I looked like Alexa Demi. Big tip. <laughs> All right, so I thought on our next old lady adventure, we would pick out some fabrics for my house and some curtain tassels. You guys know I've been talking about putting curtains in the ballroom forever. Like you see, this has shutters before, but I ripped them off and I want to do something like this to make it more castly. So I had my drape lady come in and draw some uh, drapes up for me. So exciting, but I still have to go downtown and pick the fabric. So that's what we're going to do. Dun, 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 dun. All righty. Let's see what we got in here. We're going to make our curtains gorgeous. Look at them, so beautiful. Or like that, so many choices. Wow. All these things for putting trim on your curtains, beautiful. What do you think, you guys? The lighter one or the darker one? I think this one's a little more fun. Huh? This is a hilarious thing to be shopping for. All right, we got the goods. I could spend 800 million hours treasure hunting in these stores. Look at this. They just have beautiful little, I mean literally beautiful little everything, the art. Oh, I just love it. Plus a lot of things that you don't even really know what it is. Huh. Like this. <laughs> Such a fun little Saturday afternoon. Hi. <laughs> Hello, Grandma Pearls for the win. <laughs> these look so gorgeous. Look at these cabinets full of stuff. They have so much jewelry and things. I actually get a lot of inspo for 333 based on like the antique heirloom pieces because I love old looking jewelry. <laughs> oh, look how beautiful that mirror is. Look at this, this is so pretty. Ooh. Oh my god, I just love this store. It's so beautiful. They have the most amazing fake flowers in here. I just love it. In case you don't remember, this is the store I come in at Christmas. Oh, I'm so excited for this year. But anyways, today, I just honestly want to buy a bunch more of these fake roses because I'm obsessed with them and want to put them everywhere in the house. Like, look at how real these look. You can't even tell, but when you touch them, they literally are like, they feel real too. It's crazy. Wow, with the ring, that's an aesthetic, but oh my gosh, these are just so gorgeous. <gasps> wow, oh, amazing. <laughs> Thank you. Oh my gosh, perfect. The fake baby's breath too. Like, could you die? Look at this. This looks so real. Oh. We could do something like this. My God. Oh, look at that, those are beautiful. Yay. Okay, so now it's today when I'm finally filming the haul. Um, yeah, okay, so you wanna see? Here's what I got. First thing is this ginormous vase that I saw at the flea market. This is literally huge. Look at this, it's so beautiful. It's cut crystal. It was literally an event to bring this home. I literally had to strap it into my car like a human being. Size check, here's George. <laughs> Me size reference, still huge. <laughs> this is fun. Hi, <laughs> you want to open them for me? Thank you. This, we'll open this up. Oh, this is just a really beautiful little etched glass mirror. I, oh, hi, George. I just thought this was really pretty and kind of like the one Carrie has in Sex and the City. Prop it up there. Uh-huh, kind of cute. New decor hack, start putting mirrors on top of your mirrors. <laughs> we also got 
this little guy. Yes, I know that this is empty, but like I said, I can fix it. Look at that, you put some red wine vinegar in there and now it's gorgeous. <laughs> oh, look at that, he looks gorgeous in there. All of these do have real perfume in them, by the way, except for this one, because this one was from like 1800. Now this one, and that one, which is also full of red wine vinegar. <laughs> <gasps> Nothing says old lady quite like pearls. It's giving my inner 99 year old. Gorgeous, darling, gorgeous. This is pretty obvious what it is. It is true, I have a lot of these, but this one in particular is exceptionally gorgeous. Like the carving on it and the size. <gasps> gorgeous. Ah, I also got a bunch of new books. Look at how beautiful these are. You guys know I only pick books based on their titles and aesthetics, so I just, you know, thought that one was really beautiful and these are just gorgeous. But more importantly, wait till you see these. Hi. Look at how gorgeous these books are. Oh my gosh, these are unbelievable. These are like really beautiful little old poetry books. <gasps> 1885. So, they even have the beautiful gold pages. I can't believe I got a whole set of these. These are so beautiful. Wow. I think my favorite thing I got, oh my gosh, look at this beautiful little trinket box. This is so gorgeous. Oh my goodness. It like opens up like a little treasure chest. <gasps> Look at how beautiful all the 333 rings look in there. <laughs> all the rings are on sale, by the way. Cushion rings, gorgeous. The gold rings, the radiant rings, the solitaire rings. You guys know this is literally my passion project out of my house from me to you. I just love jewelry so much. So this is just like so fun for me. So thanks for shopping. It means truly the world. All proceeds help me finish decorating the sky castle at some point in the next 400 years. <laughs> Perfection takes time. Also in hilarious news, I actually did buy this. It looked really bad on the fireplace, so I don't know what I am going to do with this. It was only $20, so I'll think of something, but I don't know. For now, it's just gonna sit there. <laughs> oh, I got a bajillion of the flowers. Look at this, can you believe that these are not real? <gasps> they look so beautiful. If you want a good laugh, these are not even close to all of them that I got. I literally have them everywhere four other bouquets of red ones too. So, you know, just enough to keep me happy for the day. P.S. on the topic of flowers, you guys know I've been talking about getting one of those like entry flower tables forever ever. Guess what I found? I found the world's most gorgeous little table on Cherish. Oh my gosh, obsessed with this. Guys, look at how gorgeous the box is. This is beautiful luxury. You excited, pumpkin? <laughs> We're having a whole little welding course here welding. on the floor <laughs> because this did not come properly. <laughs> Yay! It's literally the cutest little table I have ever seen. They do not make stuff like this anymore. Look at this pinky marble and the beautiful like swirly twirlies. This is all hand cast bronze. This is insane. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Literally so beautiful. Oh my gosh, I am obsessed with it. <gasps> wow. It's actually too heavy for me to pick up at the moment, but I'm gonna put this over by the piano and decorate it like those entryway tables with a big vase of flowers. By the way, you know my famous mood boards. Look at this. See, I put a table with flowers on the mood board. So I'll get to cross that one off later. I love you, table. Also for the living room, my couches. I picked them up a little while ago. Um, they actually look like this, which I know looks like nothing, but there's two of them and I wanna upholster them kind of like this, these true like old lady, gorgeous frilly couches. So I shopped around and look at this fabric I ordered on Etsy. Oh my gosh, it is beautiful. Exactly what I was looking for with the shimmery and look at that. It matches the rug perfectly. I also got this trim which does match this literally perfectly, though I am not 100% sure if I want to do this or not. Now that we have this, I wanna get a curtain that kind of matches the darker yellow that I had painted like in the center there, because I wanna warm up the room and make it a lot darker and warmer, so. Here's an assortment of all the whack-ass fabrics I got. God only knows. <laughs> 
These are actually a little too light. I'm not loving that. This one is my favorite. Like, see how it's shiny and beautiful? We like this one. So this is gonna make me go crazy, but you know, I don't know. <laughs> I actually saw this picture on Pinterest earlier, so we're gonna Photoshop this. Let's take a picture here. I'm actually really good at Photoshop. I do this a lot. You can see I just kind of like screw around with it until I can kind of get the vision to explain to someone. So, you know, you can see, I think something kind of like this. Oh yes, I think that's going to be fantastic. Right, Boogie Woogie? Yeah. And that's cool and all, but most importantly, do you guys want to see the ballroom curtains? So again, you guys remember what it looked like before with the shutters, and now are you ready? Ta-da! Oh my gosh, the drapes look literally so beautiful. Look at them. Oh my gosh, this is literally my fantasy. It's straight out of a storybook. They look so, so, so good. Talk about a ballroom. Oh, baby. A masterpiece. Oh, I got tassels for the curtains. So I picked these up downtown, got these with the crystals and the flowers, got these with the little stripes and the little mini babies. But uh, as it turns out, I like these that I actually got on Amazon the best, LOL. <laughs> I just love this room so much. It is genuinely, wow. <gasps> Magical. P.S. While I'm in the ballroom, I also got these frames. Ta-da! We got the beautiful pair of frames. I already took out the people, so please don't haunt me, whoever you are. Like, just look at the color. It's the original gold gilding. Amazing. Well, I'm gonna hang those up there. I am too lazy to hang them at the moment, also because I have nothing in them. But if you have any ideas of what I should put in there, let me know, because honestly, I'm not sure yet. But wow, look how good that's gonna look with the harp. Oh, it's gonna be fabulous. Just turned off the lights. Look at this. Look at the moon tonight, you guys. Oh my gosh. That's unbelievable. Wow. Part one of me decorating my house like a little old lady. I know I say this a lot, but I genuinely am so excited to be old. I'm gonna be so chic and cute with my pearls and my little white bob. Thanks for watching. I love ya. Kisses from me and probably the spirits that are going to be haunting my home now that I ripped out their photos. XO. Right now I'm gonna sit here and eat a yogurt and watch the moon. I really am an old lady.